Facebook Live. So this is huge. This is uh, How in, huge, Andrew. It's enormous. So massive. It's, uh, it's, it's revolutionary, really, if you think about it. I mean, we've, we had Periscope, we had Meerkat, Facebook bided their time, and then they brought out Facebook Live. So now anyone with one of these is a broadcaster. So if you think about that, that's going to complete, and already is, completely revolutionizing the news industry. Yeah. From a brand's perspective, there's several, several interesting bits about this right now. So the first thing is that the Facebook are uh, prioritizing Facebook Live within their algorithm. Yep. So what that means is if you're posting to your page just traditional content, whether that be text or imagery or videos, the chances are you're not getting very good organic reach right now. The, 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 the numbers that are coming out are somewhere between 2 and 8% of your page yes. followers will see stuff that you put on your page. Yep. Now, Facebook Live, they're prioritizing. So if you're not doing it now, you need to really start thinking about it. The second really interesting thing is that they're now testing ads within Facebook Live video. So let's, we, we've talked before about traditional TV. So traditional TV has been struggling because of the business model, because people are recording shows and fast forwarding through it. Now the one area that that isn't, um, that isn't true is during live sports, right? Well, live events or live sports, because you're not gonna fast forward through it. Now then translate that through to Facebook Live, and that advertising model is going to become really, really interesting. So we're going to be watching with interest to see how, what types of ads they allow and, and, and how advertisers might use uh, ads within Facebook Live video. And they've already opened up the back end of API to be able to um, layer with like multicam shoots and all sorts yeah. of production stuff. What I think is the most interesting about it is that within the 12 month period, there has now been a big shift where in some events, there are more people watching specific events live yeah. on Facebook instead of the news outlets. Yeah. And that is, is, I think it's great for two reasons. One, it's, the, it's probably humbled the, the, news and the mainstream news industry yeah. quite a lot. But two, probably exactly more to the point talking about the, um, the in, in advertising thing, the reason that the mainstream media platform doesn't exist on social, they don't know how to monetize it. Yeah. So with them being able to actually open this out, a really interesting th thing is, imagine if Facebook Live integrated like live in ad content stuff that you could monetize, just yeah. like just like Google has their AdWords yeah. and their and, and their um uh, their ad products to for YouTubers and stuff. The same thing's going to come for Facebook Live. Yeah. That's when it's going to get really interesting because you, could you imagine if someone owns a time slot that's automatically getting monetized? You don't need a TV network. Yeah. You don't need any of that stuff. I can you know yeah. get a beer partner, have a chat show, and then all of a sudden I'm like making money in real time and it's already happening with their instant articles so instant yes. articles being articles that you could, that are fed directly into facebook which open instantly and within those instant articles now if you're a blogger for example or any kind of publisher you can now have a facebook audience network which is basically ads fed straight into your article and you get a share you get a cut in the advertising spend so that's already happening for bloggers so now anyone can go and create video content yep. is what we're talking about will facebook give us give us a share well the, the, um, the suggestion, if we go by instant articles, is that's probably going to happen. And, and I think it's going, to be, it's going to be amazing because for them to be able to automate, this is almost to that point of brands are becoming the media companies. Yeah. If that happens, and when that happens, someone can create their own brand, their own media outlet, yeah. and if it's automatically monetized and automated and synced out, you don't need anyone. Yeah. You don't need media buyers, media planners, you don't, need any, you don't even need a TV deal. You can just be good yeah. and let technology enhance the talent with through technology. It's just like, I can't wait. I, I, do you think, okay, we'll call it because it's 2016, but we're sitting here in 2017. Yeah. Do you think that Facebook Live will have automated in-stream real-time Facebook Live monetization? Yes, I would, I would think so. I mean, the rate of change on Facebook and the, and, and the speed with which they evolve yeah. is huge. And you can see, one of the other things I really like about Facebook, Facebook Live is it gives people that ability to do different types of video. Yeah. So a good example would be Jamie Oliver, where he's got very polished um, uh, 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 cooking recipes that he little videos that he does and then he'll have Facebook Live where he'll just be stood outside the Houses of Parliament talking about the uh, the sugar tax or whatever it might be and, and having that that more intimate um, relationship with yeah. his with his fans and and it's you know anyone can do it just pick it up get cracking on it and you're gonna get a lot more reach than if you're doing traditional content yeah. and back to the, the thing Brad started around the strategy 
there are so many opportunities for each different business to utilize this technology yeah. as a tactic yes. for them to be able to tell a broader story. And that's yeah. once again why I guess it comes down to strategy. Yeah. I like that this section was longer because you can tell we, re we really know where it's heading. I think yeah. Facebook Live is one of the big ones. It's going to be huge.